Welcome to Fresh Paint, your equine insight and entertainment from one of the leading equine organizations in the world. We're on location today at the Youth World Championship Show in Fort Worth, Texas. When it's all said and done, we'll have awarded over $250,000 in scholarships and prizes at this show. We're honored to be able to start kids on their journey to a college education, and we'd love to have you join us next year as well. So start making plans now. And I'd also like to remind you to get your entries in for the Open Amateur World Show. We'll look forward to seeing you there. Now it's time for our Q&A segment with the one, the only, Paint Horse Pete. He's an authority in all things paint and he loves to answer your questions. So Kathy from Louisiana asks, I'm fairly new to showing horses. It's difficult for me to understand judging and just exactly what they're looking for. Where is the best place to gather information about judging that will help me show my horse better? Got any ideas? Okay, well, Kathy, you need to check out Horse IQ, APHA's Horse IQ virtual education platform, brings the APHA rule book to life for exhibitors of any breed, seeking a deeper understanding of the what's and why's behind their favorite classes. Video examples, voiceover explanations by the industry's top judges, and virtual tests put users in the judge's seat. In other words, it lets you be the judge. Horse IQ has available video modules in horsemanship, trail, ranch riding, halter, hunter under saddle, and western pleasure, as well as a library of resources, so you'll definitely want to go to horseiq.com and get signed up. Monthly rates are very reasonable, plus APHA members get a 30% discount. Thanks for that great question, Kathy and best of luck to you in your show career. So we're here with a longtime friend of mine, Steve Driscoll with John Deere. And Steve works with our APHA Extras program. So Steve, tell us just a little bit about the program and how it works. Absolutely, Billy. We, uh, we have been a part of the APHA Extras program for about the last four to five years. And it's a discount program available to all APHA members. And any time that you utilize the APHA program, a portion of that will go back and help support all the things that we do with the APHA. So I've participated in that. So Absolutely. I've got my brand new John Deere tractor. It's fantastic. I can mow my lawn in like a couple of minutes. That's it's right. It's unbelievable. So, so we've had this longstanding relationship. We've also got a new product headed our way, a new giveaway. That's correct. A freebie, something that no one has to spend a dime on. That's right. Talk to us about that. Yeah, one of the things that we have is in conjunction with the new office building being built at Mule Alley in the Fort Worth Stockyards, we're also going to be giving away a TS Gator to any APHA member, a current member of APHA. You'll have a chance to win the TS Gator uh, at the World Show uh, coming up in September. So we want to make sure everyone has a chance to get out and register to win and you can do that at the website or you can be at the show or just you know anywhere that you know you want to visit with an APHA person we can kind of get you signed up so you can be a part of that for the uh, drawing in uh, in September, the World Show. Well let, Steve, uh, you know I mentioned earlier we've been friends a long time. There, there's two things about Steve that everyone needs to know. Number one, he is a spectacular father, but he also has the stiffest hair in the entire <laughs> horse industry. No hat. So thanks, Steve. Appreciate, appreciate our long <laughs> relationship you. with Thank APHA. You very much. Thank you. So we got this little game. So this is a little effort and humiliation. So Steve's got some questions. He's going to ask me. I've got some much more difficult questions I'm going to ask him. If he can't answer my question, I'm going to throw a cup of water in his face. If I can't answer his questions, nothing happens to me. <laughs> right, Steve? We'll see. <laughs> Okay, Steve, what word is spelled incorrectly 
in every single dictionary. The word there. No, it's the word incorrectly. Really? Now just sit there and take it like a man, okay? Correctly. Okay, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Steve. It's quite all right. It slipped out of my hands. Quite all right. So, in this game, I have a question to ask Mr. Billy. Billy, in the phrase, the tables have turned. Are the tables round or rectangular? Round. That is incorrect. <laughs> they are rectangular. <laughs> so, <coughs> in return, we're going to give you. Okay. Are you ready for I'm this? I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay. Oh, no! <laughs> Whoops. No. Okay, I see how the game is being played. <laughs> you ready for this one, Steve? I am. I got the water ready. Okay. A cowboy rode into town on Friday. On Friday. He stayed in town for three days and rode out on Friday. How is that possible? It's not possible. It is possible if his horse's name is Friday. That is a very good point as well. <laughs> yes, it is. All right, Steve. I'm ready. You take it like a man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Woo. All right. <laughs> You're going to love this question, Billy. Going to love it. What do pandas have that no other animal has? Time's up. I, I really don't have Time's a clue. Up. All right. Well, the correct answer is baby pandas. So, you've dodged one way, you've dodged another, you've dodged one way, we go up and down, we go right at it. <laughs> Remember, we're friends. <laughs> Okay, you ready? I'm ready. A man has a bee in his hand. What's in his eye? An eye. No, beauty. Because Ooh. beauty is in the eye of the, of the bee holder. Bee. Mm -hmm. Yes, I love that. Okay. I love that. You ready? Today? You better go the right direction. Okay. You ready? It's like ready? soccer. Oh, man. Oh, man. Dang. All right. We'll make, the, we'll make this easy on you. Okay. We'll make it real easy on you. Last question we have is, what is my favorite food? We've been good friends a long time. Eating at a lot of restaurants together. That's correct. Your favorite food. We've eaten a few enchiladas. We have eaten a few enchiladas. But I'm going to say steak. That is incorrect. The original down the street is one of my favorites. You know? I so had it right the first time. You had it right the first time. He had it right the first time. Where would you like this? <laughs> Where would I'd you like, like to like just it? drink it? Would you like to just drink it? <laughs> <laughs> right, left, center. Good Thanks, game, Steve. my friend. Good Thanks, game. Steve. Appreciate it, Bob. <laughs> <laughs>